from New Mexico State Police, but hired by APD anyway, responded to the scene in the foothills last March. He sees an old colleague, state police officer Chris Ware. Sandy doesn't realize it, but Ware's dash cam is rolling, picking up this conversation that will change how lawyers, judges, and our community view this shooting. Where are they got you guys going? Where are they got you guys going? I don't know. Did I ask for Stickley? Well, I don't know. The Stickley? I'm going to shoot him with a shotgun here. You got a Stickley? I got it. I just said. The Taser shotgun? Yeah. Oh. I thought you guys got rid of those. I got one. But, wait, here's what we're thinking. Because I don't know what's going on. Nobody's doing this. Civil rights lawyer Shannon Kennedy represents Boyd's family in a wrongful death lawsuit against APD. So two hours before, he's saying, I'm going to shoot this man in the penis. And then two hours later, he's escalating the situation so he can do just that. It's chilling evidence of malice, and it's stunning that he has not yet been criminally indicted. He spells out, even before he gets to James Boyd, what his intentions are. Absolutely. Almost exactly two hours before he shoots James Matthew Boyd in the back, he says to a state police officer that effing lunatic, I'm going to shoot him in the penis. It's crystal clear. And he says it with contempt in his voice. A month later, APD investigators asked Keith Sandy what he meant by that shooting in the penis comment. In an internal investigation transcript, Sandy is quoted saying, Jokingly, just kind of locker room banter, just told him, you know, don't worry, I'll shoot him in the pecker with this and call it good. But a few moments later, the transcript shows how Sandy recanted his statement. The investigator asked, did you say anything to Chris Ware about shooting him in the pecker? Sandy responded, I don't know, I don't think I did. But again, that audio tells a different story. Sandy tells the investigator the guys in his unit make crude jokes all the time. In fact, the jokes can get so hostile the unit has a safe word, China. When an officer calls China, all jokes must stop. Sandy explains he was merely joking about shooting Boyd in the penis. To, to play devil's advocate with you, he does very elaborately talk about how this was a big joke. He, he never really meant to shoot James Boyd. That was never his intention. This was just a big joke. Do you buy it? Of course it's not a joke because he went forward and actually shot him. Because clearly he has complete disregard for people suffering from mental disabilities. I mean, he calls him a expletive lunatic and in the next breath says, I'm going to shoot him in the penis, which is I'm not just going to shoot this guy. I'm going to shoot him and make him suffer. I'm going to emasculate him. And what is so mortifying about this shooting, which, thank goodness, we have a tape to show exactly what they did, was that instead of shooting him in the penis, he actually shoots him in the lower back. So had James Boyd not turned at that moment to set down his bags, he would have been shot in the penis.